What's going on everybody, this is me Alex, and in today's video we're taking an in-depth look at the City Tweak OXO 2. If you're familiar with the world of jailbreaking your device, you're probably most familiar with the most popular tweak called OXO. Now, that was introduced in the old iOS 6 model, well in iOS 7 there's a new one called OXO 2, and this pretty much allows the same thing just for iOS devices. To access the tweak, all I have to do is go into settings and scroll down all the way to the bottom until you see OXO 2, and then click on it. Once you have done that, you're going to notice that you already get some of the pre-installed features without even have to activate the application, only just to go right ahead into City and install the application. You don't have to have an application on your home screen, instead it's hidden in your settings application itself. So it's sort of concealed in it, the iPhone itself, you have really hard to notice it. Once you scroll down, you have three different options to enable. You have multi-center, you have quick switcher, and then of course you have hot corners, which is another one I'm going to show you guys later in the video. But for me, the most one that's probably the popular one is the quick switcher because it sort of combines, or multi-center, sorry about that. It sort of combines the multitasking and the control center at one little spot. So it's much easier to access and shows you all the applications. If you slide up on the home screen itself, you can have the option to close all the applications at once, not having to have to go and scroll up on each application, which can become very annoying. Taking a look at the quick switcher application here, you have the option to go ahead and turn on and off all these tweaks or a mini tweak sort of merged into one tweak itself. It's very cool and I definitely recommend it to those ideal people. One more thing I really want to show you is hot corners. Now that's later sort of, but uh, one major thing, like if you go into the application, you're going to notice that my home button sort of stiff. So if I go into the application itself, you're going to realize that if I slide up, I can actually switch the uh, application just by sliding up on the bottom left hand corner. And it's called quick switcher, by the way, it's sliding up on the left hand corner and then going to another application without having to exit the application using the home button itself and having to go to a different application. It's just a much faster process if you already have one open. Instead of even having to use the multitasking center, it's now called Quick Switcher from OXO2. Definitely go check it out, pretty cool. Coming up here now is Hot Corners. Now this is another one of my favorite tweaks, two reasons. One, it's quick, and two, my home button's technically broken. So it, you have to press really, really hard just to fix it, uh, just to go back to the home screen. And it's not really worth the repair that this iPod is even worth anymore. So once you go into here, your quick settings, you have your display, do not display, auto dismiss, auto dismiss, do not display, display, and you have the auto dismiss after one, three, five, eight, and eight, even eight seconds long. That's pretty cool how they did interpret that into the City Tweak OXO 2. So you have the auto dismiss after one second if your device is not even using it. You have the close all applications tweak. You have the uh, exceptions from these applications. You can go ahead and set those to your liking uh, depending on your style, style of choice and which applications you do not want to ever exit out of. Taking a look inside of OXO 2, you also have the... Um, if you go outside of here, you have the creators, which are very, very familiar creators. Sentry, which went away in iOS 6 but came back in iOS 7. He's a visual interaction designer who designed original OXO, Apex, Alt, KB, Apollo, founder of A3 Tweaks, and Quizic. Well, don't be afraid. I know it's not easy, but definitely go recommend you follow these two on Twitter. Tell them I sent you because they will congratulate both of you. And you have the option down below to follow A3 Tweaks themselves on Twitter if you want to, uh, to your liking. But if you click on the auto support, it will automatically get a little ticket to send to OXO2. So if you guys want to check that out, if you have got any problems, technologies, problems, definitely recommend you go ahead and check this out. Currently right now, it's about $4 on the City Store, but you, there are ways to get it free. Go check out my previous video on how to do that. It's very, very cool, and I'll all see you guys in my next video. But until then, please make sure to subscribe to my channel if you guys already have not done so. Until then, see you guys in my next one. Peace.